How are you? I'm doing very well. How are you? Well, we are uh, pretty happy here in the Silicon Valley. You, you should be. This is a well-deserved um, uh, announcement. And I know you've worked hard on this one. Well, it's not just me. We, I have here with me the uh, Carl Gardino, the president of the Silicon Valley Leadership Group. And walking into my office is Mo Kayami, who is the president of uh, San Jose State University. And we have someone here from Mayor Reed's office. Uh, and as I think you're, you're aware, uh, when we decided to, um, to go for it in the uh, Silicon Valley lingo, uh, the leadership group, San Jose State, and the mayor uh, assembled all the interested parties and put together our, uh, our best pitch. And we've been in touch with the department uh, throughout, and along with my colleagues, uh, Anna Eshu and Mike Honda, and really the whole congressional mm -hmm. delegation. Mm -hmm. So I think of this as a win for our people in our, and a win for the tech world, and especially the startups. So yeah. thank you so much well, for calling as in. I'm sure you know, we um, looked at all the information that you and a good number of other cities sent and looked at actually four different areas of you know criteria, which included geographical diversity, regional economic impact, ability to recruit and retain employees and ability to engage the IP community and um, you know San Jose was one of our top cities that came out of that so you, you won this fair and square not just because you wanted it and um, lobbied hard for it but also because you simply come out of the top um, in terms of the criteria that, that you meet in your area for innovation. Well thank you so much this is Carl Gardino. Madam Secretary, this is Carl Gordino with the Silicon Valley Leadership Group. First, thanks for your leadership for our nation. I just wanted to take a moment to commend Director Kapos and his Deputy Chief of Staff, Azam Khan. As we told them months ago, your process being so transparent, accountable, and measurable uh, with the algorithms you employed to meet what Congress set in the legislation in a thoughtful, policy-focused way. Whether it had been Silicon Valley or not, we were entirely impressed with, were obviously happy that it did lead to Silicon Valley, yeah. but we made it clear well before this decision we could make no bones at whatever you picked because it was such a thoughtful, accountable, and transparent process. Uh, Madam Secretary, we have the president of San Jose State, and as you know, uh, San Jose State has really stepped up to yes. the bat and wanting to collaborate with the office, not just at this stage, but throughout. And I know, Mo, do you want to say anything? Again, uh, good afternoon, Madam Secretary. It is, it's a wonderful day for the Bay Area, for uh, California, and for the United States. I believe this was one of those uh, collaborative projects that really brought everyone together in a true partnership. And as uh, my colleague uh, Carl Gardino mentioned, we were very impressed with the process that was taken. And I think that having a, uh, an office here in uh, the San Jose in the, in the cradle of creativity and epicenter of innovation for the country, I think it's going to be such an important element. And San Jose State being a university that is very diverse and it's in, a, in our student body, and many of our students would be uh, potential interns, as well as uh, many other opportunities for us to work uh, hand in hand with this uh, with the office uh, locally. And we feel that uh, we have a responsibility to make sure that this will become the best pattern office in the country. Yeah. Well, thank you. As you know, um, the presence of universities was one part of our criteria. Since they are, you know, engines of innovation and, a, you know, a, a, really a source of both good employees as well as, you know, people who need our services. So um, the presence of San Jose State mattered in terms of this decision. Well, that's great to hear. And, of course, we have other great universities right here in our valley, Stanford, of course, and Santa Clara yeah. and Berkeley yeah. just across the way. Uh, I'll say probably it's not true that in every part of the country you'd be having high fives and fist bumps about <laughs> patents, but that's true here in Silicon Valley. So this is very exciting news. We're so thrilled uh, at the decision that you've made, and we know this is just the beginning of our work. Uh, we, this is a long collaboration that we will be having with, with you, and uh, we look forward to that. Yeah. And, and as you partner with us, Madam Secretary, yeah. there will be no red tape, only a red carpet. So All right. to that sounds good. I'm actually hoping to come out there next week, either Wednesday or Thursday, and um, 
you know, I'm, I'm hoping that those of you who are around will be able to, you know, will do some announcements and uh, will be able to attend that event and be part of it. I, I suspect, um, uh, Congresswoman Lofgren, that you may be back in Washington next week. Okay. But um, we we'll, will, we'll the, pull together yes. the group that's there. We will be back in Washington voting not to repeal the uh, health care bill, uh, but we will do everything we can to make sure that people uh, know all about this. And we have uh, very good people and the mayor and and the president, mm -hmm. the two presidents here. Yeah. Uh -huh. We'll make sure you get the red red carpet treatment. Good. Well, and as you know, this is a, uh, we haven't selected a site. This is um, for location somewhere in the San Jose larger metropolitan area. And um, one of the things we'll be doing in the near future is sending a site survey team out to look at a variety of different options. And I know that you'll continue to give us lots of good information in that process as you have in the past. We certainly will. And as you know, both the city and the, and the university offered co-locations. Yes. Yeah. Maybe that works. We yeah. don't know. We'll certainly explore that and we'll, we'll do our best to help find a place that's accessible uh, and that is affordable and that works for the office and works for the tech community. That's great. I appreciate that. I'm looking forward to moving this process forward as quickly as we can. And that would be uh, great. And if you would like for the announcement, the university would, it would be honored to have you uh, at the university next week uh, or at the city, whichever works best for you. Good. I'll pass that along to my staff. I know they're just sort of putting this together right now. Very good. Thank you so much for your call. It's just wonderful news, and the whole valley is cheering. Well, congratulations to all of you. I hope to see you all soon. Thanks. Thank you. Good. Bye-bye. Yeah. Bye-bye. Yay. 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 Yay.